David? David? Yeah. Officer Gravy, Chief. Oh, yeah, what you got? A woman matching the description of Maureen Gorman was seen at the Pine Valley Airport last night, late. Okay. What did the responding officers find? She cleared out before they arrived. Oh, Any idea where she went? Uh, she was in the gate area. A lot of planes were taken off. I'm talking to the ticket agents now. Okay, good. Well, keep me up to date. Chief, there's uh, one more thing. Yeah? The woman wasn't alone. Oh. Who was she with? Your husband. <laughs> Thanks for the information. Wow, what inspired this? <laughs> well, can't a husband do something nice for his wife without arousing suspicion? My favorite. I called the station. They said that you had just left. Oh, I guess we just missed each other. Hmm. Some big go down last night? I'm not sure yet. You know, if you plan on pulling an all-nighter, it wouldn't kill you to at least, you know, leave a message. I suppose other married couples communicate more clearly than we do. <laughs> well, I know that you can take down supervillains and go toe-to-toe -to -toe with the DA, but when my wife doesn't come home, I do get a little nervous. Sweet. I was here, you know. I waited for you for a while. I just didn't realize that straightening out that medical mix-up. It's gonna take you quite so long. Oh, yeah, yeah. It was, uh, it was a lot more complicated than I had expected. But it's over now. And all is right in the world. Indeed. I just want to forget about last night and focus our attentions on making our future. you do it? Uh, do what? Accept everything I say. <laughs> You're my wife. Which means exactly what to you? All right, Anna. Talk to me. It's just hard, that's all. It's just hard. Uh, marriage? Trust. Well, it's, it's not exactly my best event, either. I really... <clears throat> I really wanted to question you last night about why you were at Wildman. I just... I, I... Right, but then you went with your heart instead of your, your training. Here, have a seat. Apparently, I did. Well, you know what that means, don't you? Tell me. I... Well, that we're pulling off what everybody thought was impossible for us. That, uh, pulling off a good, sane marriage. I could feel closer to you. Anytime. Oh, I, I don't mean physically. I mean, there's never been a problem with that. Hmm. But I, I liked it when you showed interest in my job. I like that. You want me to interrogate you? No, no. A question or two wouldn't hurt. You know, it shows you care. Hmm. Okay, Anna. Come clean. What exactly were you working on last night? A troubling case. Oh. Huh. An evil villain threatening the peace of Pine Valley? Definitely threatened something. Hmm. So do you have a profile on the guy? Actually, it's a woman. I'm closing in on this woman called Maureen Gorman. In light... Uh, who is Maureen Gorman? And why were you out all last night looking for her? She's just this woman. She had her purse stolen, you know, and, uh, um, by that guy from the park, you know, the one you didn't like me questioning. Hmm. So you don't have any real business with her? No, just that my job is to protect people. Mm -hmm. And at the very least, I should return her purse and convince her to testify, don't you think? But you couldn't find her? No. The last we heard, she'd gone to the airport. 
Apparently to leave town. She's disappeared off our radar. I guess you didn't need her purse. We should get dressed. Go to the wedding. I don't want to miss anything. <sighs> Haven't you had enough of weddings? Definitely. But I'm tough. Yeah. Okay. Oh, hey. Um, before we left last night, you, you said that there was something that we were going to celebrate. So go ahead. Um, what are you waiting for? Tell me the good news. My good news. It fizzled. Uh, it was a case I was working on. Thought you had it all wrapped up, huh? Yeah. But it went cold. Sorry to hear that. Oh, I'll get to the truth. No surprise there. And when I solve it, you'll be the first to know. I hope so. Because just so you realize this, I am very much interested in your work. Really? Yeah, yeah, you know, even a, a dead-end case like that Maureen Gore or... Gorman. Gore, Gorman, right. I mean, even a case like that fascinates me. You're really fascinated with purse matches? <laughs> well, it just feels very heady to be in the know. Yeah, it does. We should get to Wildwind. Is something wrong? No, just, um, you know, just to let you know, I'd, I'd much prefer to stay here and, and focus on our own personal goals. Well, Alex and Dimitri, they're not going, and I really, I promised Edmund. So. Right, right. Have you told Edmund we're trying to have a baby? I know he's really big on family. There's time for that later. Get dressed. into weddings. Oh, I don't care about the I do's. Come on, did you score one stripe or two? Come on, what were the test results? Test results for what? 